Afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, everyone. Please share this message as quickly as possible. This is a breaking news. Please share this message as quickly as possible. Uh, Emmanuel, this, uh, Emmanuel Lee, this message is not for you. What a cupita, it's a secret leaked. Uh, it's not for you. Um, I'm out to broadcast this message for people that are interested to know what is going on. Not, uh, I'm not. So please, uh, it's very important. People of Ambazonian understand what's going on, and if you come here for insults, you'll be blocked. This is very important for the people of Ambazonia. This directly relates to Ambazonia. Any insult on my platform, you'll be blocked. Just know that. I have no time for rubbish. I have no time for bullshit. I've come here to deliver an important message. If the people of Ambazonia do not take this very seriously, all right? So I am not here to entertain anybody, and I have no time for insult. This is my platform. I created this platform for a specific purpose. There is an emergency, a situation which could change this revolution right now. So pay attention. Any insult, you'll be blocked. This platform has no room for bullshit. So share as you join. There is an emergency situation that's about to take place in La Republic du Cameroon. And I want Ambazonian people to be prepared. So share as quickly as possible. Let me warn again, any insult on my platform, the person will be blocked. This platform, I have no time for nonsense on, on, on people's nonsense. I have no time on people's politics. I have no time for bullshit. There is an emergency military crisis that's about to take place in La Republic du Cameroon. And that will change this revolution. So you Amazonian people, wake up. And understand the game that's about to be played on the Amazonian people. So any insult, you'll be blocked. I don't come here to waste my time to receive insults from ghosts, from, from, ghost, from fake profiles. Alright? I'm here to deliver. So better have some fucking respect. Alright? I'm not coming here to play any games that one of the politicians are playing with the Ambazonian people. I have no time for that. I didn't create this platform for that. There is a threatening situation that's about to take place in La Republic du Cameroon. And that could, wipe, that, that could change this revolution forever. So pay attention. Share as fast as you can. Let's understand the game that's about to be played on our people. And let's be ready for it. So keep sharing. I'm going to start in exactly one minute. Share and invite as many people as possible. People need to get the message quickly, fast. We need to prepare. This is dangerous. The game that's about to be played on the people of Ambazonia, it's a very dangerous game. La Republic, it's about to play a dangerous game on this revolution. 
So this directly affects the revolution and the people of Ambazonia and the aspiration for the restoration of Ambazonian independence. So as you join, you share immediately. Yes, Noel, thank you very much. All right, Ambazonians, good afternoon to those of you in North America. Good night to you, to those of you in, uh, in Asia. Good evening to those of you on Ground Zero. And good evening to those of you in Europe. My name is Lucas Asu. As we speak, there is a threatening development about to take place in La Republic du Cameroon. A coup d'etat. It's on the way. There's a potential, a poten there's a potential for a coup d'etat to take place in La Republic du Cameroon. And I'll tell you why this is eminent. And I'll give you the reasons in which France, it's now about to change the political game in Cameroon. And the reason why they want to use the military to do that. And why this coup d'etat is about to take place. All right? So let's dive into it. As we speak, La Republic du Cameroon right now, there is nervousness within the ranks of the government of La Republic du Cameroon. A good comrade, a good friend of mine, uh, Fondong Daniel in Texas, the United States, just delivered an online video in which he alerted the world about this. We, have, we are following through right now. I've had some contacts with some intelligence people on the ground. I called some high-ranking people on the ground to confirm this. There is serious nervousness in La Republic du Cameroon capital. This is within the political ranks. Why? Let me tell you the game that they're about to play. Because Camto, who said, who proclaimed himself as the winner of the 2000 of La Republic October 7 election, projected himself as the winner. That tipped the Bamlike people now to rise up and want to defend their what? Wants to defend their win. Now, the Bia regime, which we know, they've guaranteed to proclaim Bia as the president. This has now created a tension within the Republic of Cameroon within these two dominant ethnic groups that they are about to clash through uh, 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 post-election violence. Bia is going to be declared as the winner. Remember, Bia owns the, 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 uh, Bia owns the parliament, owns the senate, owns the constitutional council, which he just created. This constitutional council he just created was there to do only one thing, to certify his results for, for elections. So now, they don't want to tip up the nation. The, the military is looking at this like, okay, if Bia declares himself as a winner, there will be a civil war in La Republic of Cameroon. There will be an ethnic uh, 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 war in La Republic of Cameroon. La Republic of Cameroon will erupt. So this will tip off anything else politically. Now, France now wants to use a new game. And here is the game France wants to use. France wants to solve two problems using one strategy. Okay? France wants to solve two problems. By the way, uh, Handes Taku, I told you, anything on my platform, any insult, any negative comments, you will be blocked. I'm here to deliver an important message. So respect yourself or you'll be permanently blocked on this platform. I have no time for anybody's nonsense. You guys know that, all right? So let me carry on. So La Republique of France now wants to use this opportunity to carry out a military coup d'etat in Cameroon. Why do they want to do this? They don't only want to solve the political problem, but they will also want to solve, they want to stop the, uh, they, also, they just want to stop the Southern Cameroon's revolution. So they want to use this fake thing called a coup d'etat in order to secure Southern Cameroons militarily. This is the new plan. This plan as we speak, it's what, it's eminent, it's possible. I'm not telling you that it's going to happen. I'm telling you that there are greater possibility that this could happen at any time. They want to do this primarily, not so much to stop not so much to stop the political game in La Republic of Cameroon, but so much to take over South, back Southern Cameroons. To take over back Southern Cameroons that is falling off. That is finally, right, 
breaking away. That's finally uh, breaking away from a fake union, from a false union. So there is an imminent threat of a possible military takeover in La Republic do Cameroon. I've contacted some intelligence people on the ground. I've spoke to some high-ranking people on the ground. There is nervousness at La Republic do Cameroon capital. They don't know when this will take place, but this is very eminent. All right, hold on a second. All right, goodbye. All right, so, but this is very eminent. So this is the breaking news that France is about to use the military to take over the government of La Republique du Cameroon and then squash the election so that there will be no more fighting between Bia and Camto and then they will preserve this integrity in French Cameroon. At the same time, the military will take over Ambazonia. This is what's about to happen. So Ambazonians, be ready. Should this happen, it will erupt, it will erode this revolution. So for me, I think this is France's new strategy in order to keep Southern Cameroons occupied. Because the moment they do the military takeover, they will impose military generals, military commanders in all of Southern Cameroons. What we have seen as militarization of Southern Cameroons, it's nothing. When the military take over, it's a different ball game. We've seen that. This is the new French mafia. This is what they want to do now in order to derail the, 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 the Southern Cameroon movement for the restoration of independence. It's not so much to stop the political anarchy in French Cameroon, but it's so much more to keep Southern Cameroon secure as part of La Republique du Cameroon. The this is the new strategy. This is the strategy. So pay attention very closely. In the coming days, in the coming hours, in the next few days, begin to pay attention. And we, Ambazonians, we must get ready. Whether it's a military takeover, whether it's a political crisis that erupt in La Republique du Cameroon, Ambazonia must be free. This is our one and only chance this time around to be free. This is our one and only chance, whether, it's, whether there is a political uprising in La Republique du Cameroon or this uh, military takeover that's about, to take, that's about to happen in La Republique du Cameroon. Whatever the situation is, whatever, whatever happens in La Republique du Cameroon, we Ambazonia must stay focused, must stay focused. The coup d'etat will not be part of us, we, the, our Amber boys, our people, we make sure that when this coup d'etat happens, we, our people should find a way to permanently disconnect Ambazonia from La Republique du Cameroon. So this is all, this is just what I have come to deliver. I want us to be smart. I want us to anticipate because this is all about anticipation. When you can anticipate, then you can, be, you can make yourself the winner of the future. But if you cannot anticipate, then things will take you... Things will take, uh, things will happen, and then you feel like there is a surprise, and then you feel defeated. So that's why Ambazonian leaders, the diaspora, the leadership in diaspora specifically, they have to be very smart at this time around. They have to be very smart that they either work together to secure Ambazonia, or we're going to lose Ambazonia. So Ambazonian people, I've delivered the message. It's totally up to you guys how you do this, all right? It's totally up to you what you choose to do. Whether you want your leaders to work together and secure the restoration or you want them to, to continue and doing their, what I call paparazzi and then we lose the entire revolution. For me, I have done my part. I've given you truth. I'll always speak truth. You may not like my truth. You may not like truth. But we will not, we will not achieve restoration of independence lying to ourselves. Either leaders lie to us or we lie to ourselves. Okay? I have done my part for you. I've told you the truth. I've given you the insight. I'm telling you what's about to happen. I've done all these predictions. I've told you guys. Most of what I have said in these revolutions, they have happened. This is a possibility. We're not saying it's happening. We're saying there is a great possibility. This is about to happen. And it could directly derail this struggle. And this is France's new strategy. All right? My name again is Lucas Asu. I've delivered the leadership coach, the strategies. Sometimes most people don't like the truth, 
because they believe that the, the deception of lies could protect them from, from truth. But the only thing, the only thing we need right now, I've delivered the truth to you. Now it's up to you, the Ambazonian people, what do you do with this information, all right? I'll be reaching out to leaders and be guiding them on the mindset about how they can prepare themselves, okay? So get focused, stay focused, Ambazonians. These are very critical times. These are very critical times, Ambazonia. We need to stay focused. We need to stay focused, all right? So God bless you guys. This is all I came to deliver. Have yourself a beautiful day. Stay safe no matter what happens. Stay safe. Make sure you're safe. Make sure your family is safe. All right? So have a beautiful day, guys. Have a beautiful day. These are critical times. I'm going to be on the phone with a lot of people now. All right, bye.